And new tonight, a woman will be back with her family in Little Rock after being sex trafficked. It was in Miami and she sent a text to her father telling him she was in danger after realizing the man she thought she loved was actually putting her in a terrible situation. TSV 11's Ashley Godwin has more information on this, including the signs you need to know that someone could be doing it to you. This is 29 year old Kyron LeJohn Richardson. He is being charged with human trafficking after Miami police say he preyed on a Little Rock woman. It's a crime that can happen anywhere, including here in Arkansas. Here's how you can protect yourself. A lot of times when these individuals are saying a lot of the right things, um, you know, they're using or trying to get to an individual that may be very vulnerable at the time. The Miami Dade prosecutor says the 21 year old victim from Little Rock was lured to Florida after she and Richardson exchanged messages on social media. He said things like she was too beautiful to be in Little Rock and she should come to Miami to be with him. A lot of times these things are drawn out. You know, it could, for lack of a better term, it could be a grooming process, right? It could take one to two years or six months. It doesn't happen overnight. After she reached Miami, she tells police she saw violence against other women who lived in the house with Richardson. That's when she texted her father, who notified police. Arkansas ranks in the top five in the nation um, for trafficking instances, and this is just reported. Alex Smith with Partners Against Trafficking Humans, or PATH, says there are some things to be aware of when talking to strangers online. If it sounds too good to be true, it probably is. And if you are planning to meet up with someone from the internet, let a loved one know where you are going. And parents, know what apps and websites your kids are on and make sure you are aware of who they are talking to. I always just recommend, you know, keep that, that connection open. And sometimes it does resolve itself to where you have a positive outcome. Richardson was also found with $18,000 cash on him when arrested. When a search warrant was executed at his home, they found several guns as well. Now, if you have concerns of someone in a situation like this, you can reach out to PATH. We have that information on THV11.com.